Okay, how to do the orbit with a dumbbell. You want to choose a bell that is moderate weight. You should easily be able to grip the heads of the bell. Um, this is important. If this is difficult to do, then uh, probably don't want to do this exercise due to dropping hazards. Okay, so first thing on this exercise, we want to get this weight attached to the rib cage. That's how it gets plugged into the obliques or the core in general. So the way we do that is from midline, I'm going to stack the weight into side right position. I should be able to let go of the weight. It should have integrity through the alignment of my forearm. From this position, I am not going to lift the weight over my head. I'm going to keep it stuck to my rib cage below the top of my head. I'm going to lift my elbow. I'm going to bend over to my right, loading my left oblique compartment, and now I'm going to let gravity just bring the bell behind me. It's important that I don't touch the back of my head if at all possible. Now I'm going to start letting gravity bring me over to the left, loading the right oblique compartment, and if I do that properly, I can get under my forearm, and then I'm going to use my obliques and my midsection to bring me back. Once again, stacking the weight, it should be aligned or resting on the rib cage so that the obliques and the midsection are engaged. I'm going to open them even more. Now I'm going to start circumducting the midsection, letting gravity assist the obliques and midsection musculature, coming all the way around, ending at the midline. Okay? All right, let me know if you have questions and have a great weekend. Bye.